There we go. Perfect though. Perfect. Hopefully, I think it is. It is. We lost the girl who got it on her own. It'd be good for you to let it go. Let it go, let it go. Ain't none your business. Ain't none your business. Okay. Hey guys, I'm back with another video. So, today I will be doing a back to school haul. Yeah. So we're just gonna get right into it, starting with the accessories. So I went to this place called Sand Moon, where I always get my accessories. So go down there, cheap accessories, known for all accessories. So I got these gold hoops, and y'all probably like, why you got gold hoops if you got gold hoops right here? Because these are bigger. And then I got these cross dangles. Ask me out. And one in rose gold, but I thought it was gold, honestly. But hey, I'm gonna use it like it's gold. Me, why do people always like to do stuff when people making a video? Well, it's not, but it's just this, and it's. Ask me out. Ask me out. Ask me out. Ask me out. And then I got two of the same necklaces, one in silver and gold. Both colors. Them like coins that's in now. Like that. Then I got the stone shirt, the Rolling Stone shirt, but it says the stone. And this came from Target. And it fits really cute on y'all. Like, I love this shirt, but I just haven't found nothing to wear with it. But maybe I do now. Forever 21. I was going to say Fashion Over. But Forever 21. Honestly, I didn't see enough. It kind of let me down. Me personally, not saying it's not a bad story because a lot of people find a lot of stuff. I just didn't. But I did get this sweater because it is too cute and too soft and it was just $15. So, yeah, and I got it in a medium. So, so then I went to Upscale for Less. And I spent like a hundred dollars in there well i didn't oh i'm not trying to brag in this video i forgot to say that but yeah i'm not just trying to give you ideas and even though most of y'all already did our school shopping some of this stuff is still in store so to help you so this is the bag that it comes in so clearly they don't have a bag but a skill for less <laughs> as you can see but I got this cute blouse, and this is inspired by Kylie Jenner when it was in Italy, Rome, somewhere. It looked like that. I don't know. I, I'm probably way off. But she had on... I'll show a clip. So this is where this top came from, and it fits very similar to that. So it has two strings, and the back is just like the front. Then I got... This shirt, because you know I love fashion, but don't got the budget, so I had to get. Versace, Versace, Medusa head on me like I'm no Manati. Little shirt that puts you in the mind of Versace, but looking on the camera, you just actually it looks like a bunch of sun, not sun, yeah, sunflowers, but they're not. <laughs> this I don't think it is. Like it's not. So it kind of reminds you of. Versace, but heck no. Girl, I ain't got no money for that. And I got this in a large. This is probably one of the few things that's in a large simply because I wanted a certain look. I wanted it to, to be big. So that's why I got a large. Once again, this light. Sorry, my nerves. Sorry, my nerves. I got this. It matches the shoes, so that's really what I wanted it for. And I always just been like I knew for the school year I wanted one of these types of shirts, and it's a crew neck. So yeah, I got this white top that's kind of like short fit but not. And I really like this shirt, honestly. But it's just a simple white shirt with black lettering. Dress it up, dress it down. That's all from Upscale from Less for Less. 
please, if you stay in Texas or just Google it wherever you live, they have some good stuff, real good stuff. Urban Outfitters. And this store is expensive as crap. Okay? I don't care. I spent $80 on three pieces. I got this Adidas top. Just like that. And I really just like the jersey feel of it. So that's why I wanted this Adidas top. At this tank top, that was $20 for a piece of a shirt. But it's fine. And this is a different color. Like, usually you don't see this color. So I just wanted to try something different. And yeah, I actually really like it. It's really cute on. Of course, we can wear this to school. I'll throw a jacket over it and make it work. And I just love Urban Outfitters little tags that just hang like that. Last but not least, I got this bold red little top. And it is so cute. It goes around the neck. Y'all, it is so freaking cute on. And I got this originally from my friend. Like, she wore something like this like over two years ago. And she said it was at Hollister. Never found it. Two years later, boom, $18. So yeah, and it's really cute on. I If you wanna spend $18 on the top, this is the top to get. And red is really good. Like red is not my just color, but hey. Uh, uh. Girls look it, look it, mm. mm. Next. I'm going to go to Cotton On. Cotton On. I told you I couldn't see. But yeah, I love the bag. Like, I wanted to go there and buy more stuff because of this bag. But they switched to paper because they're trying to save the turtles. Save the turtles and get rid of plastic. So yeah. So the first thing is these jean shorts. But they're approaching the knee, so I don't know if they're capris or what they are, but yeah. And this is like the cutest shorts ever. And this is what makes these cute. Because if you're are really skinny, then you get the like the that little cute look of having like baggy shorts, I guess. But not baggy, but like yeah. And then if you're thick, like me. Then you get the little curve fashion over look. So yeah, so that these jeans can go both ways and they're really good. And then I got this sweater and it's really cute on. These arms look like nobody can fit into this, but trust me, it is gorgeous on. Gorgeous, I love it. I got this white top regular white top and y'all probably like if you can't wear this to school why it's in your back to school hall some people can and two jean jacket throw it over they won't know long as you keep it on so yeah it's really cute on and it's kind of cropped so i will have to wear high-waisted pants or a skirt with it some people might can show their bellies at school the graphic tee is this shirt which is like so cute to me. I love the little Tata like bleach look on it with the little rainbow, the little dash of color. But I ain't gonna lie, my favorite part is the back. I don't know what all this is saying at all. Cause who about to read that? I just see Texas, Arizona, all this place. And I know this is a brown shirt, so it might tend to match your skin color. But actually, it doesn't wash me out. And I don't know what this is. Is it a fish? A duck? Don't that look like a duck, kind of? Oh, it's a person diving in a lake or whatever. But I promise, y'all look real quick. Tell me if that look like a duck. It's a duck with a really thin neck. Really nice, really simple. Because simple is in, y'all. Like, doing all that extra. You can, of course, because that's in too. But also being simple, like that Kanye West look, that's what this reminds me of, that Kanye West look. So I like that. Expensive but looking broke. <laughs> I'm the opposite. Wait, hold on. Expensive looking broke. Yeah, because his clothes are expensive, but he looked broke. And I'm looking expensive, but I'm really broke. Yeah. 
topic. Hot topic. And a lot of people sleep on hot topic. But girl, boy, sister, brother, cousin, mother, granny, dad. This place should not be slept on, especially with your graphic tees. Go here. It's kind of expensive, just a little bit, but trust me. <clears throat> Clear oh. nose piercings because we cannot have this at school, sadly. Oh. So, yeah, I needed these. So, go to um, Hot Topic if you need to get any clear piercing that is showing, especially if you just can't have it. I'm so sorry if y'all can hear people talking at the back. Okay, anyways. And then I just had to. I don't have a car yet, but I do have keys. Okay. To the house. So I got this little keychain, but because of the color, it's pink and it's nice. And I kind of like pink, but mainly what it say. Not today, say. Not today. And you know what? Girl's about to put her keys on it right now. Right now. Two hours later. There we go. Buy two, get one free. So I got three graphic tees. This white one that I just liked and that also kind of matched some shoes that I bought was this. And this looks huge on camera. Like really big. But it's a small. But I think because it's a men's shirt that... um. It looks like that. And the thing about Hot Topic, you need to open the shirts and see because some of them are just girl shirts and then some of them are unisex. I never thought I was the person to love a show so much you actually get the shirt for the show. But two of my favorite shows, Stranger Things and Riverdale. I love those shows. Love them. So, in dedication to Riverdale, I got this. Yes, and I am a cheerleader, boo. Do I have the shorts? I should go get the shorts. Oh, I could be this for Halloween. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm going to be a river vixen. Oh, shit. I'm going to just say it. I do not know what this stands for. This HBIC. Now, I am obsessed with this person for now. Like, I really love her right now. They listen to her music every day, day in, day out. I got my driving playlist. I got my get ready playlist. And most of her songs is that playlist. Can y'all guess who? I give y'all five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Boom. I'm probably like, who is that? I can't see that. Ariana Grande. I slept on her for too long because to be honest, I was not a fan. But her songs just keep breathing and breathing and breathing and breathing. This is the shirt. I've been looking for her graphic tees like forever and ever and ever and ever. Oh, no, God! No, God, please, no! 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 Yeah, I'm a fan, but hey. If y'all can comment down below how many times y'all seen Ariana Grande in this video or and how many times I sung a song of hers then you get to be right. <laughs> That's it. But see if y'all can. Comment that. The second to last store. Coming out of the expensive side again. Along with Urban Outfitters. They partners in crime. Especially to your paycheck and your pocket. And your wallet and your credit card, debit card. Whatever you want to use. American Eagle. 
so expensive. Spent 100 something dollars. There's just two pair of pants up in here. Yeah, two. But I ain't gonna lie, the quality is life. And so at my school, we can wear ripped jeans, but they can't show any skin. So that means you gotta get the backing. And so I just got these blue ones, nice dark wash. I recommend Jenkins if you don't shop here and try mine. But they fit good, like skinny skinny people, curvy people, halfway curvy, thick thick people, they can fit almost every group. So great quality, nice thick soft jeans, just expensive as you can finish that. Because it was buy one, get one half off, is these mom jeans. And I know they look big, like my mama could feel them. But they're in a size two. They do run big, but these fit perfect. They also got holes in it with the backing. And here's a fun fact for anybody watching that goes to school like that on my school. Just take some of your old ripped jeans and just go buy fabric. You can buy little fabric pieces and just put it behind there. Or you could just wear tights under it, but that's uncomfortable. I get wedges enough. So yeah. And last but not least, I have been sleeping on them for years. Like. But they came through today and a few weeks ago because that's when I bought both of it, all this stuff. And the name, H&M. I have never shopped at H&M this much ever. I got most of my wardrobe and it's still like four or five, six things still at this store that I want to get. So if y'all would like to cash at me, please do. I got some more studs because studs do not last all year round. I got some camo pants because I also been looking for some camo pants. And they do need to be taken in a little bit at the waist, which I can go get that fixed real quick so i was interrupted i don't even know if this quality is still as good but hey then i got this top and it honestly is a little big on me and honestly i want to give thanks to h&m for making long sleeves not too thin to where you're still freezing cold but not too thick to where you're irritated and getting headaches like this is the perfect quality of a long sleeve shirt. Like seriously, like this is a summertime shirt just as much as winter. Like it's perfect, like a spring, I guess, but fall color. And so I know it's close to my skin color again, but it doesn't wash me out and it's so cute and it fits so good and comfortable. This is a statement piece. Like when I step out, I gotta step out confident because I have a whole outfit for this. And it is this, you know, how this pattern has been in and then a blazer, but it's like a coat, like it's long and it is cute. It gives me all model vibes, like, but wherever I go in it, I'm gonna be, can't tell me nothing, can't tell me nothing. Then I got this little blouse. Of course, I'm gonna have to wear with an undershirt and it is cropped and we're not allowed to wear crops. So once again, how wasted? I'm gonna need you to come through. And it's really cute is this jacket, which I think is supposed to be like a hoodie dress, but I didn't really wanna wear it as a hoodie dress. So I got a small, but it's like super duper long and big. And no, it's not out of the men's, it's women's. And I just have to crop it a little bit. Yes! What tie up? Yes! Okay! I am! Okay. This is also Ariana Grande. The same design, but on a different color. And it's the long sleeve, great quality. And it's Ariana Grande. 
Okay, two pairs of jeans. And the first ones is these boot cut or flare. I don't know, either one, whatever you wanna call it. And they fit so cute. They just kind of long, but I just like the little detail of it. And it's, um, oh, it's a mini flare. And it says regular waist, but it fit high waisted on me. It's cause I'm short. Then I got these just white and believe it, they're like straight leg and they actually get tighter. They fit really good. Fit my waist. They're regular waist, but they're high waisted on me, of course. Like pretty or mid way, mid rise. And these were just ten dollars. And I was looking for some light blue jeans, simple blue jeans. And so that was the automatic like have to get like who's still selling ten dollar jeans? Where? If y'all know a place, please tell me. And then I got this this jean dress that's kind of looking a little weird right now because I tried it on and was too lazy to put it back the way I found it. But it fit so cute on. But now I have to find like something to wear under it. So yeah, first day outfit coming soon. You might see this again. We're almost done, people. Hanging now, hanging now. Hang it, hang it, hang it now. Hang it, hang it, hang it now. Hang it now, hang it now. Hang it now, hang it now. Hang it, hang it, hang it now. Hang it, hang it, hang it now. No, God! No, God, please, no! 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 Last but show not least. They are such a cute fit. They got the elastic band, which made me kind of nervous, but low key, that's what makes it fit. And it fit good. This gray hoodie. Cause hoodie actually stands for a hood on the back. But if it's a pullover, which means no zipper, then it comes over your head and then a zip up, which zips up. But all of them is hoodie as long as it has hoodie. My leather jacket. And this was originally $50 and I got it for 10. And then I got this huge, huge winter coat. And I stay in Texas. It do not get this cold. Well, some parts of Texas does. But hey, whenever it got cold and everybody freezing their butts off, this is not going to be cold. Your girl. And this was originally like 50 something. I got it for $11. It was a long road. But guess what? The road is now closed. <laughs> oh shoot. No, it ain't. It's open again. It got fixed. Cause I forgot the shoes. Real quick. First up, all Nikes, which kind of bothered me because I'm usually pretty versatile. But I got these in a size five and what they used to call them the gangster nights. They're not called that anymore. But yeah, they kind of remind me of bowling shoes. They not. They are so cute. Like I said, I just love it. And with the little detail and the little detail and the detail just so freaking cute. Some Vapor Max, my very first pair. I got those shoes that I just showed in a size five. Then I got these in a six and a half. I could have fit a six, but I like the, how the six and a half fits better. And I just got these shoes with the nice detail and the bubbles and the threading. Nike React Prestos in a size six. They're maroon like all the way and they reflect a little bit on the, oh shoot, Ooh, bad hands, bad hands. Now we have officially came to the end of the road. And that is it for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on post notification. See you in my next one. Your business. Ain't none your business.